Welcome to my channel. This video is for a DIY Mother's Day cards using Dollar Tree chalkboard tags. If you haven't done so, please subscribe and don't forget to tap that bell for notifications on my uploads and live streams. I'm using hot pink cardstock. It's 11 inches in length, so I'm cutting it at five and a half inches. I'm using my mat as a guide along with my cutter so I can cut it exactly in the center. This is a little embosser pen and I use it to flatten out my cardstock. So I just roll it. You can use a pen or something if you want. Sometimes it'll kind of discolor the cardstock though, so I really like this pen. I've had it for many years, so I don't even remember where I got it. I apologize for that. You can use whatever you've got, and you can also buy cards, blank cards that are already made in the right size with envelopes, and you can buy those at Hobby Lobby and other craft stores. So I'm using these Dollar Tree uh, tags chalkboard tags and then they also have these chalk writers so it's just chalk but it's in these pen plastic pens so it's easier for writing and they are kind of fat though so it is still you still need the bigger tags to be able to write stuff like this so I'm just writing it uh, in as pretty of writing as I can and I'm using this double-sided foam sticker tape and I also get that at Dollar Tree as well and I'm just cutting long strips, a couple of them, and then just put them on the back side of these tags. It's super easy. And just peel off that backing, and so you can tape it to your card, to your front of your card. Very easy. You just want to press down really good, and the chalk did not smear at all. I was worried about that, but it did not at all. And so you just want to put that down uh, wherever you're wanting it and then press down a little bit. And I flipped it over just to help from messing it up. And there it is attached. It was super, super easy to do. Now I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit extra to it. You don't have to do this step if you don't want or if you don't have stamps. It's just a little flower stamp. I think it's a Stampin' Up stamp and the Stampin' Up ink. And here's a hot pink chalk writer they had them in different colors they had blue a pink white and i can't remember if they had anything else but those were all dollar tree and then the, of course this the round one and they had them in all different shapes and sizes the tags and then this uh, foam stickers you can buy it in the roll or you can buy little circles so whichever you prefer those are all from dollar tree cardstock is not from Dollar Tree as far as I know they don't carry that yet and then I'm just centering that flipping it over and pushing down again I'm stamping if you don't have stamps you could use stickers or any kind of little embellishments you could find here they are and I'm going to go ahead and add some little black rhinestones so I'm putting down some E6000 glue so that they will stay on and won't fall off it's just a little dab of it and putting these little black rhinestones right in the center. These rhinestones came from Hobby Lobby in a big package. Dollar Tree also sells some diamond mesh wrap that has a sticky backing, or they sell different pretty ribbons so you can make little bows and put on here. So there's lots of options at Dollar Tree that you could add little fun stuff on these cards as well. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment, share, like. Please be kind with your comments. Please be kind to others. And as you see here, I just wanted to change up my little end video. And I did a little video here of Lulu when she was just a puppy. So I hope you enjoy that little fun ending here. Hope everyone has a safe and happy Mother's Day. Happy crafting, everyone.